Life Audio. Thank you for listening to Your Daily Prayer, a podcast dedicated to helping you find the words you need to connect with your Father in Heaven. No matter what is going on in your life today, you can trust that God wants to hear from you. Right after this short word from our sponsor, we'll pray through today's prayer on purpose and transformation together. A Prayer for Purpose and Transformation Written and read by Jessica Van Ruckel. In all my prayers for you, I always pray with joy because of your partnership in the gospel from the first day until now, being confident of this, that he who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus. Philippians 1, 4-6 I can remember when I first received Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. My heart filled with peace and a heavy burden lifted. I knew then I would never be alone and hope would always be mine. I grew hungrier and hungrier for God and His Word. I wanted to know Him more and more. But time passed and life went on with hardship after hardship. I came to a crossroads. Would I remember God and my original response to Him, or would I go my own way? I chose Him and embarked on a journey of purpose and transformation. We experience spiritual salvation by God's grace in our act of faith in Him. His grace is unearned favor, love, and the enablement to finish our race. We get the privilege to faithfully complete our journey on earth. Purpose and transformation happen through the surrender of our daily lives to God. While we do not gain salvation through works, we do express our salvation through ongoing spiritual growth and development. Salvation is a gift lived out and fulfilled through a continual daily surrender to Jesus Christ to follow His purposes. This takes great determination on our part while we rely on God's grace for this determination. Following God is a beautiful partnership through our willingness to say yes to God every day, our faith and God's strength and empowerment through us. Hebrews 13, 20 and 21 support this concept and says, Now may the God of peace who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus, the great shepherd of the sheep, By the blood of the eternal covenant, equip you with everything good that you may do his will, working in us that which is pleasing in his sight through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. God's work within us depends on our faithfulness and cooperation. When we face hardships, do we turn to the world's wisdom for help or do we turn to God's word? When we struggle with fellow followers of Jesus Christ, do we turn away from the body of Christ or turn toward Christ for guidance through the struggle? God works in us if we let him. He takes our yes and works by his spirit to produce within us the desire and the power to do what is good and right and to fulfill his purpose for our lives. We don't come to God in a completed, perfect state. We come to Him when we're in the middle of our God-defying way of life and recognize we need Him. So we turn from our own way to follow Him. This takes us on the path to transformation and purpose. In reliance on Him, we resist temptation to live in defiance of His ways. To find our purpose We allow the desires of the Holy Spirit to become ours. We find victory over evil when we use every God-given means to overcome available to us. 
Transformation happens when we take on Jesus Christ's character. God is faithful to complete the work He began in you when you responded to His invitation to receive His salvation by grace. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank You for sending Your Son, Jesus Christ, to die for my sin and to rise from the dead to conquer spiritual death once and for all. Transform me, Lord. Make me into a reflection of you. Let me take the seriousness of reverence for you and give me a passionate pursuit of your purposes in my life. You do not force yourself into my life, but I don't want to resist your call. I surrender my life and my days to you. I know I will face hardships and I may forget to rely on you and to trust you. Turn my eyes to you and remind my heart of my commitment to follow you all the days of my life. I want your work to be evident in my heart as I choose faithfulness toward you. I will cooperate with your Holy Spirit to transform me. Take my willing heart and make me into a reflection of you. In Jesus' name, amen. Your Daily Prayer is a production of Life Audio and Salem Media. If you liked what you heard today, please take a second to rate and review this podcast in your favorite podcast app so that more listeners like you can find the show. For more faith-filled, inspirational podcasts, visit us at lifeaudio.com.